Okay, hi. So we're gonna try and do a spread for the Margaret Miller challenge. This is the next day from yesterday's video, so. Okay, so I don't know if I quite remember what I said, but I showed you all the pages, I know that. So today is the fifth week, and it's, um, the prompts are a path or road, something cold, a favorite word, a piece of calendar, a uh, paper with a repeating pattern, and the bonus is an illustration. So we're gonna, I don't know if I should try a, did I, did I show, uh, yeah, I showed you this. Okay, so I wonder if I should try a two, two page, this is such a big book, right? So part of me thinks I wanna do a two page spread, but part of me thinks, um, part of me thinks that, um, some of the papers over here so I can see my marks. Part of me thinks that this is going to be really hard for me because I don't know if I can do a two-page spread. So now this is interesting. There is an illustration right here of something. Illustration of a house. So let me show you what I pulled out. First of all, I pulled out these paper. Well, first of all, Mrs. Coggs. Mrs. Coggs, uh, Mrs. Cog's, let's put this up here. Mrs. Cog's Crafts, and I pulled out the Monet um, group she has because, well, there's something cold right there. I may or may not use that, um, but okay, let's uh, take this out right now. Get myself some space here. That's something cold, a barn in the snow. But I took it out because I kind of wanted, uh, there's some, the, the frost. So now I'm looking at all the stuff, the frost. We'll remember that. <laughs> I took it out because of this pathway here. Um, and there's a path here with the guys. This is a sheltered path. This is the irises in the artistic garden. So let's, uh, let's take this guy my book up here let's, uh, let's go like this let's go um, I really like the irises so I don't know if I, I don't know if that's what I'm going to use but I like that I'm doing this because Rachel said I should do it. it. Makes me nervous. I think at some point I'll forget you're there. How's that? Okay, so I like the irises here. I like this path in the irises. Seems like something I would want to see or do. That, um, over there. And here's the other path with the man walking. Let's go like. My my ruler came a little warped, so hoping I can. Okay. I like the idea of a path. Um, I think life life is a path that we're on. Um, so I kind of like that. Sometimes we don't know which way it's going. It's hidden before us. That's a path that goes out in the distance. So I kind of like those two. Then there's another path here that's a garden uh, pathway, garden path, and um, it's kind of overgrown and dark. Oof, I need to do that. Well, live and learn. Sometimes our paths seem dark, don't they? Okay, so I think I have, oop, I think I have that part down. Sort of decision. Then I purchased, um, I've, I've been wanting to purchase this for a while. It was in my save for later bot bin. What I like about this is these are flowers made out of butterflies. And this is by Louise Hensel, I believe you say it. I thought I wrote it down somewhere. 
I did write it down. I wonder where. Oh, it's over here. Louise Hensel. So these are so beautiful. Look at this. She has a kit. I'll put the kit below. If I use it, I'll put the kit below. Um, but look. So this flower right here is all butterflies. I just think it's in ingenious. Lovely. Look at this one. So I bought this kit thinking I might want to use it somehow. <gasps> look at that. Colors are very rich. I print them on my laser printer and they're very beautiful, rich, very rich. So all butterflies put together to make flowers. So I love that idea. And then there. Except for right here, these look like they're, has a bird here. This, this looks like it might be a real flower. Butterfly, butterfly, butterfly. Oh, and that looks like a real flower there too. Okay, so I might want to use that for the bat or for something. I don't know. Put that up there. We have the past. We have cold. Um, I had something else for cold. Where is it? Um, I chose a couple stamps um, that Lucy sent or Elizabeth, and they're Canada, and this is a glacier. So maybe I'll use that. Another one here. It's another one here, just like that. Another glacier picture. Okay, so then I have this path here. It looks like a photo, and I think it's from this book. No, it's not. It's from another book. Nope. But it's a photo, and it says, A pleasant place to sit and watch for toads as they come out of their nights hunting. <laughs> but it's a cute stone path. It's a little bit hard to see, but maybe. So then an illustration. So then, you know, I guess a... Oh, wait, here's another one of her papers. I forgot. Here's one of her papers here. I might have, I don't know if I have two of those. So this is out of a book called The Psalms of David uh, by, I forget his name. I'll put it down there. I've talked about it before in other videos, but this is an illustration. Could possibly be an illustration of like a little pathway up to whatever that city is. And so maybe that. Um, I also have another page of his. It has an illustration. I rather like this because of the, the church. I like how this looks right here. I might use that. Um, these are things just... So a repeating pattern. I mean, is this a repeating pa pattern? I really like to use that. So I don't know. It's so pretty, right? I love this. Okay, so that. I have a couple things here that have been sitting around. I'd be like to use them sometime. This a piece from a, from a calendar that's actually up on the wall right now. <laughs> So I don't know how that's going to work, except for that it's September now, and my birthday was in here in September the 16th. So maybe I'll use that. <clears throat> and then on the side over here, I just have a bunch of papers. This tells me what the prompt is in case I forget, which is, oh, no, this is, this is the old one over there. Um, I had a gasket here in case I kind of wanted to, you know, focus on one area. But it's not really messed up at all. I might have to... I don't know. Might have to do something with that. Then I have a bunch of scraps over here to cover the uh, cover this part first before we work. So do I have? Oh, I have my word here, which is faith. And uh, they clip together, but I put uh, painters masking tape stuff on there because I always they always fall apart for me. So all right. So do I cover everything? Piece of calendar, paper, repeating pattern, bonus, and illustration. All right. So, I'm looking at this to think if I want to save any of this. I guess I should decide if I want to use any of these other papers. See, now this, this one's going to be really hard for me, I think. So, I don't know. I might not be able to use these this time or maybe something else will come to me. I don't know. I really love this one right here with that, with that butterfly. Hmm. Kind of looks like a tunnel. I don't know if I want to use those for background because I think they'll just overwhelm so I'm gonna cover this I'm thinking I don't know if I want to leave this illustration free or not I might I don't know so over here on the left I have a bunch of papers that are just sort of 
uh, miscellaneous. So what we like to do is cover all this to just sort of get your juices flowing. That's the way I look at it, just sort of get you started with figuring out what you want to do. So this is what I'm going to do. I wish I had a little basket, Rachel, like you do. I don't have that. So I think I might leave that right there. I'm still thinking about that. I don't know if it's going to work in my what I want to do. So let's get my glue book over here. And we're going to glue some stuff down. I might do that. Let's see. I love this paper, Rachel, but I'm so stingy on using it. I love how it feels. I don't have many pieces left. I don't know. I have a one, this could maybe go in a journal spread, maybe. Probably not that big, but. See, this is what happens. Oh, this is a piece of it. Okay, so let's use this. Let's um, pour it down like this, maybe. This goes a little crooked there, but we could go like this. Okay. All right. My, we, so let's see, in California, this is, it's actually beautiful out. We've been, you know, we've been having, the fires aren't really near me, but we're like in a valley in between all the fires. So all the smoke will get stuck. <clears throat> and I had such bad asthma but it seems like it seems like they have i don't know i'm not keeping up this is one thing i don't really watch the news and stuff because it's just so depressing right i don't want i can't stand being depressed anymore so i don't i mean as far as all that so i used to watch when i had cable oh look i covered it do i want to cover it the side now this is an old card that i don't use so i just make sure i don't show that side all right, so um, well, I guess I decided to cover that. <laughs> and I have some, <clears throat> sorry, I have to have water here. Some of this is from Rachel at Roxy Creations, um, kit about letters, old letters. So I'm gonna use some of that here, I think. Or maybe not, I don't know, we'll put it right here. I don't want to use all that. I don't think I want to use that. Oh, here's a nice piece. So we're going to tear this like this. Um, so anyway, um, today is very beautifully, a beautiful sunny blue sky, which doesn't happen much. They're always putting those planes in the air and muddying up the sky here. Uh, but... But right now, as I look out my window, it's very blue and pretty. There's none of the smoke. So either, I don't know if the fire, oh, what I was gonna say is, um, I don't really watch the news. I used to always watch Fox News and it almost made me have a heart attack all the time. It was on and everybody, everything was a catastrophe and I just didn't want to. It just made me so nervous. I, so I decided, so we quit having cable. We got rid of our cable and we stream online now. I'll just, you know, on the, on the TV online. We stream through Roku or Apple TV or something like that, you know, so so I don't watch any of that. Um, so I don't know. So I want, well, guess my way of saying I haven't I haven't figured out um, I haven't figured out how the fires are going. But right now it doesn't look like there's any smoke outside. And if I looked, it's probably air quality is probably pretty good. I'm going to guess. So what if we put this, you know, this is that paper. Look how pretty it is. Sorry, I go off screen probably to tear. So it's really pretty here. I think it's very fall-like. Um, I mean, we're going to probably still have some hot days. In fact, today might be in the 80s. Uh, so, you know, but it's definitely cooling down, which we all like to hear, right? We like to know that. I think I'll probably use that. I just don't know where. Probably use this. Uh, maybe... Maybe this will fit right here, right? Covers most of it up. It doesn't have to cover it all up. So, let's see, this is kind of goopy right there. So we might, um, 
So it seems like the weather is really nice. Uh, it won't be, I don't consider weather nice <laughs> until it's, uh, until it's somewhere around 50 degrees because I just don't function well in the hot, in the hot, in weather that's too hot. So, so with that said, you know, you can, okay, so I like that. That's nice. Nice background. I'm moving things over to this way, which might be hard for me because I'm right-handed. All right, so I have some of this left over from Medieval Mirage, so I might, I don't know if I will, but I might put that there. I have some ledger paper. Has a date, 1891, I like that. So maybe I'll put that here like this. Let's put this on here like, oh, I like the number up there very much. So this wet, this is, I hope you can see me. I think I'm within the, I tried to mark on my table where I need to be for you to see me. So that's nice. I don't know if the fires are contained, but our smoke, if it's, it might be going somewhere else. It might be blowing to Arizona or something, or I don't know, maybe the coastal, maybe the coast is blowing the, the blowing the smoke the other way. So I don't want to put all the ledger page on one place since I put this here. So she's another piece of one of her letters. Um, so, so that's nice. And uh, all a bunch of birds are starting to come back to my home, so I'm very excited about that. Uh, so it's about time for them to all start flying. Fly, some of them fly out. A lot of the hummingbirds. We have Anna's. <laughs> I don't know if any of you care, but we have Anna's hummingbirds that are here all year round. So they stay, but I don't think so. Um, but the. Um, Thought I'd use up some of these little pieces. I can't really deal with other places, you know. So the Anna's, so the other ones, the Rufus, the, um, what's all their names? We can put the Rufus, the Rufus, uh, Rufus and Black Chinned. I think the other little guy, which I haven't really seen in my yard before, uh, he's called the, uh, he's called Rufus, Black Chin, and he's called, um, I can't remember his name. So those ones that are here in the summer, they will be moving on. They'll be moving on to better spots, I suppose. But the Annas will stay here all year. So we have the Annas. Um, and we just had the white crown sparrows come back, which, yay, it's like I throw a party. <laughs> I don't really throw a party, but I feel like I want to throw a party. Oh, let's put this one over here. So we don't want to cover all of this up because I like the date and stuff. The date's up there, but I think, let's cut here. Let's cut here, and I mean tear. Um, so that's nice. I'm very excited about that. I saw my first one. That means the uh, juncos are going to come back, and uh, who knows who, because we're getting so many new species in our yard since we're converting it to like a pool area. And not only that, oops, I tore it. Not only that, we have some rats now, which ugh, I don't like that. So my my son comes over as the great hunter and uh, sits there with a BB gun, and he killed one. But there's a whole family now, and we gotta gotta get rid get rid of those until we you know we'll get we'll get complained. They'll complain about us being a place. Hey, we have a very nice area. It's not we're not it's not gross. I mean, we have a really nice. We live in a nice area. It's really nice. It's just, you know, rats are everywhere. I can't help it if they're, if they come in here. I think maybe, I like this. It's a different kind than this, it looks like. Yeah, let's put that on. Uh, so, so yeah, so we have the rats. So, so now we got to kill them. We don't want to use poison because poison just causes them to go off and die somewhere. But then the raptors and other animals will eat them and then, then they get poisoned. So I'm not a naturalist crazy person. I just really love birds. And since I can, all of a sudden I've got all kinds. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll see all my bird pictures and Facebook. I'm so crazy. I know I'm crazy. I know it. No one needs to tell me that I'm crazy. It's another piece of her. Another piece of her uh, letters. So. 
So anyway, so uh, yeah, so that's happening in my world. But it's, uh, the, our church is still going to, they've canceled a lot of the things because of the COVID. But, um, but we're going to have the harvest thing that we always have. Where's that at? We're going to have the harvest thing for the kids that we have. We're still going to have that, but we're not going to have a potluck where people cook. Or, um, But we'll still have a pie contest. They're going to make food themselves. They're going to serve food themselves to whoever comes. There's bounce houses, a lot of fun things. So, um, you know, yeah, that's what we're... Our governor's a little bit crazy. He wants everyone to not do anything for months. And the truth is, I mean, people have to eat and stuff. I mean, they can't just... They can't just not, uh, he doesn't want anybody to go back to work either. I wish this was a little darker. Maybe I could go with a lighter page. But he doesn't want people to uh, do all kinds of things. It's crazy. So it's really frustrating because he doesn't even want us to have church. We have it anyway, so I don't know what's going to happen about that. But we have it anyway. Because people are big, they're they're old, they're they're mature. They can choose whether or not to come. The people like me, you know, I'm in the group that would catch it and be serious. It would be serious because I have a um, compromised immune system. So, uh, so if I caught it, it would be really bad. Because I have, I take medicines to um, suppress my immune system. So if I caught the roid or whatever we're calling it. Um, I mean, it could potentially be very bad for me, but other people, you know, most people, especially in California, no one's died from it. That's any, anyone who's died from it, mostly in California are, are elderly like myself. I consider myself that. So I'm not, I'm not coming down on anyone. All right. There's my background. All right. Okay. So now. If I don't do a double page spread, it will see. <laughs> okay, so I need to have a path or rope. So let's look at this up in a repeating pattern. I kind of really want to use this. Maybe I'll just do a, a one page or just one page. We could put it on both sides. It could be two pages. A repeating pattern. To me, this is, right? So we're going to use this, I think. Oh, so now if I do something like this, I could have it wider, unless I really want, I don't, I don't know if I really want to try and, let's tear it. Oh, what was I saying? So, um, we still meet, um, but our governor doesn't want any, that you're allowed to go to stores and stuff, but you can't go to church, so that's ridiculous. Uh, so, um, the elders and stuff at our church, is, we're still meeting, so it's no big deal, we don't consider it. If you don't want to come, don't come. And the people who are at risk, then they make their own choices. They choose not to come. So anyway, so we're, um, and that would be me. I'm one of those people. Well, like the other, my grandkids come over once a week to help with chores and um, watch the car for my husband. I like that, not bad. And um, I think we should accentuate the 16, right? Because, you know, that's a special day in September. <laughs> I know, so weird, right? Okay, so, um, uh, so anyway, well, how should we do that? Just put a circle around it? I don't think I have any circles. Oh, you could do O. I don't think I have any. <laughs> All right, well, I'm gonna just put a circle. Put in a circle. Put in a circle. There he is. I'm reaching over you. I'm sorry. Oh, what about this guy? These smudge up. I wonder how that, I don't know if that'd be good. If I I'll use this pen. This pen kind of sometimes is not so good, but we're going to go like this. There we go. Me. All right, so we'll do that. That's uh, that. We're still deciding about this. What if we put this down here like this? I kind of like that idea. So what if we tear this just sort of... Oh, it's like it causes me pain. I think Rachel might have sent this to me. I might have bought it in one of my paper packs from her. Oh, it makes me sad. Okay, it's okay, Pam. I'm gonna put this right here like this, I think. 
yeah what was I saying oh yeah about that so anyway I don't know why I was talking about that it's a good day I, I don't know I don't know I lose my train of thought that looks like a repeating pattern to me unless she means like I don't know it's our interpretation right I might put this like that, but I'm decided. So I don't know, should I do a double page spread? I'm probably already using so much time. How long has it been? 25 minutes, no one wants to watch this. People wanna watch this? Okay. Um, okay, so we need Okay, let's go like this. We have something called a path of road. Let's find the path of road. That might help us make our decisions. And an illustration. We have this illustration and this illustration. Psalm 7, 1, David, da da da. 10. That seems odd. Okay, so I'm gonna just tear out the um, I'm gonna tear out the I'm gonna tear out the little church because I like him. Keep some of his like that. So if we did a double page, it'd have to be over here. This would be the illustration, right? Yeah. What if we, okay, so anyway, around here, it's gonna be a lot of the harvest. So you think the air gets good, but then it's not because they're gonna start harvesting almonds and walnuts. And when they harvest that, they uh, what they do is they shake the trees really bad. Like, I remember I, when we first moved here, I lived near a, a walnut grove. I guess we're doing a double page spread. Well, no, a, a almond grove. We were in front of it, and then there was an almond grove was right behind us. And then <laughs> there's so many things I didn't know when I first moved here, but anyway, that was one of them. And um, so the almond grove, um, the, one day I was, you know, at home, whatever, with the kids. And so this was, oh gosh, I think it was 35 years ago, a really long time ago. Anyway, uh, the, all of a sudden the house started shaking like it was a really bad earthquake, like like really, really bad. And I thought, oh no, what's happening? What's happening? And it turns out they were harvesting the almonds. And so what they do is they shake the trees with, um, with a machine, like a, I think they pull it like with a car or something, but with a machine. And um, so I like that. They pull it with a, they do it with a machine and your whole house shakes because we were right in front of the, we were right in front of it. So that was scary. But anyway, when they do that to the almonds and whatever other nuts that they have to drop down, walnuts, I don't know if they do pecans here. I don't think so, but I don't know. They do walnuts. If they do walnuts, they should do pecans, right? Oh yeah, because they're famous. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, Pam. I get on these, these things. Anyway, so, um. That fills the air with dust too. And then we have a garlic plant, so we don't need that. We have, so I got two of them. We have, we have an illustration. That was the bonus. Paper with a repeating pattern, I think. Piece of calendar over there, favorite word there, something cold, and a path or road. Okay, so. So where's some Monet's? Did I cut them out already? Uh, so anyway, I thought I probably cut them out, didn't I? Where are they? I'll try and steal that card. It's the other side, and I don't. It's not a usable card anyway. There you go. Did I cut them out and put them over here. That'd be insane, right? I've done worse. So maybe I will use this. I haven't decided. Oh, they're right here. And I also have this road. I think it's too big. So we're going to decide against that. And here these are. 
So um, this kind of speaks to me. It's kind of like you go alone down life's road and, uh, you know, you have to go from there. <laughs> kind of like that idea. I might use him. These are something cold, so those can go just about anywhere like this or like that. I don't know, like that. We'll decide. Um, no. Uh, even though I really like this, no. Um, I like this guy a lot like that, like this. Um, no, those aren't going to work out. Maybe. Okay, so I like this like this. These can almost be anywhere. In fact, they could be just sort of like this if we wanted to. Canada, or we could just use one. I don't know. So then over here, I think I'd like to... What if we use some of this pretty stuff that I want to use? So let's see. I really want to use this because I like it. So what if we... What if we fussy cut it out? <laughs> let's see how good I am at this. I love this... this uh, I'm just gonna go slow right now like this and we'll go from there. So anyway, what I'm trying to say is that autumn is a really bad time for uh, lungs here too. Um, but I will say that we have a garlic process, garlic processing plant. And uh, I personally love the smell of garlic. And so, you know, the, at some point, you start smelling all the garlic in the air, which is, I kind of love that, so. Okay, so we have this guy like this. So see, I think I will really like something like this. We could cover that up. Oh yeah, I need my calendar still. Where'd the calendar go? Calendar. guys probably see it somewhere, don't you? Well, that's spiffy. Well, let's just work on this. We'll figure the calendar out in a minute. So I kind of like this very much. I like it a lot, a lot, a lot. And I think I semi like this. I think I like it. I might just use the one that says Glacier on it right here. Like this. Or even could go down here like this, just like that. And then my, where's my calendar at? Where'd it go? Sorry, everybody, sorry, sorry. Calendar, where'd you go? It's insane. should be here somewhere. Mm. No. I'm sorry, guys. You're probably going in. You could just can't take it. I'm finding it. Well, I hope I'm finding it. it. Must be over here. Where am I? Put it somewhere right here. I love this. I just want to say that I love this. <laughs> so I'll probably glue that down this minute. Hmm. Oh, here it is, because it's upside down. So we could maybe go like that with the calendar. And then I'm going to need a place to put the prompts. You know, write the prompts down. I might be able to write them on here. It would, if I did that like this, it would kind of offset this brightness right there. I don't have any of these are tea dyed and I really don't want to mess with doing that right now. So I'm thinking like this, like that. And, and the date and the, and the, and the word. Okay, so I think I, what I'm gonna do here is write the prompts on them. I'm gonna do that over there. So I'm going to glue, I'm going to glue this guy down right here like this. I want to cover this part right here. So this like that. And I'm going to put this guy under here, I think, just like that. So I think, first of all, we'll put this guy down here. 
and I'm not covering anything too exciting, so. So we're gonna put him right about here, like this, correct? Correct, I hope, like this. Oh, I love this. We're gonna put this like this, because we can still see the 16, that'll be perfect. I'm sorry I'm gluing off screen. Okay. Okay. go okay so I like this with the idea of faith uh, written somewhere like that because he's walking down a lonely road uh, Canada it could also be like this I got to figure out where to put this this and um, my word and then I'm thinking yeah I'm gonna write on here the prompts <laughs> if I can write that small man dangerous okay so we're gonna do um, hashtag Hashtag 2020, 2020, CO5, like that, okay? And we're gonna go um, a path, or road, a something cold, something cold, a favorite word, favorite word. This is when my writing starts getting really messy, so I'm trying to keep it together. A piece of calendar. See, look at the different the sizes are trying to go up. I don't want to do that. Um, a paper with repeating pattern. See, I kind of ran out of space. And bonus, I'll just put a star because an illustration. Okay, I'll put my word right here. Will it fit? I think it will. Perfect. And uh need my stamp pad. Okay, so we have this like this. We're gonna put this, I think, right like that. And we're going to get uh, this. Or let's see what colors. Let's try this green color. Let's, let's try it. Okay. Let's try it first on uh, this. Is, let's try it first on here. It's not bad because I like that green right there. So if you do it like that, then you do it the second time, it's too faded. So we're just gonna go like this, like this. Okay, so. Ah, oh, there we go. Not bad. Picks up the green from the other side. Okay, that seems good, right? So we're gonna put this guy right here, right? That's what we decided, because we were gonna put him here. I would like him to sort of, okay, do we want this to go over that or? Or this over him? What was else we have to put on this? Sorry, reaching over this, but we don't, that, we'll find a place for that. Oh, I don't want to cover that. So I don't want to cover that. But I think I want him to come over. Is that good? Or under, probably under. Let's go under. Okay, so first, let's put him over here is what we're going to do. So we put some glue down like this. 
you're gonna hope like that. We're gonna put him right here like that. Let's see if that looks good. I learned that from watching Rachel because you don't that way you don't have to worry about trying to get it on the other side of the of the doily and having it tear all over on you. Okay. We have the path right here. Like that. Let's look a little boxy. I don't know. I guess all that matters is that I like it. <laughs> I obviously want to get better in my, in my, um, in my abilities. I used to do, um, I was an editor. I don't know if I said this before. I was an editor in the yearbook. I wasn't the whole, ed or the editor in chief. I was a section editor. You had to do layouts, but, um, but with pictures. And they had to be a certain way. They couldn't be, they had to be more, conventional I guess so I'm trying to struggle against that since I know I was thinking I wanted to put this guy on here but the problem with this is this guy looks a little bit too something then you'd have to put something here so no next time and we have something cold so what can we break up this is pretty good there we could maybe put it here like this or up here like that kind of break up that it looks so square. Oh, now I showed that. <laughs> it's no good. May I have to see if I saw that. See if I can scratch it out. Okay. Okay, so I keep liking this thing. It's it's and it's getting all bent being around here. I keep wanting to put it somewhere, but I don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> and I like this bird I cut out and he's not gonna, obviously not gonna work. The colors don't work. Um, hmm. Okay, so, um, I think I'm just gonna put it right there. Call it a time, call it a thing, call it done. Okay, so a path or road, a uh, something cold, a glacier, favorite word, faith, piece of a calendar right here, and uh, paper with a, with a repeating pattern, and an illustration right here. So I think I got everything. So I guess, Number five is done. So I'm very excited. I think it turned out okay, A-OK. -okay. So it's the first time I've ever done a video that is, um, that is recorded, you know, like with something I've made. I'm sorry for that. So I don't know, I hope, I hope it's okay. This looks like he's coming up a bit right here. I'm going to use a little Fabri-Tac and kind of, because I have this little nozzle on it. I'm going to get it down. And I can go just, come on. You're going to stay down just, there we go. Over here too, but seems. So, turned out not so bad. I love this. Let's see if um, there was some, let me put this back in. It seems that there was little, I was cutting this out, and yeah, there was these little butterflies, or bees. I really like the bees. Um, where is the little scissors? The scissors. Let's cut a bee or two out. Because look how cute they are, so cute. So just let go. Try and get him. Not that great at this. I'm sorry if I'm off. There we go.
like I'm going to try and be perfect because you can't be. So I encourage any everybody to try this Margaret Mitchell challenge. Um, I'm sure you can adapt it to however you want to do it. I wanted to do a glue book that could keep them all. Hopefully it'll keep the whole year. I don't know once it gets full how that will go, but... Uh, Ah, okay, let's put him somewhere, maybe, or like this, or, oh, I don't know. Oh, man, I'm bad at this. Okay, I think I'm going to put him, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what we choose. I don't know if it really matters, then. come on. Hmm, the other one's even smaller, so I think I'll just leave it like that. So I like it, very happy. I like it. We saw the other ones we did, so I keep thinking I should put some plastic over here to protect the sky, but I don't know if I will. So I decided to kind of do things that I enjoy. It doesn't have to all be about, you know, you can incorporate things like, um, like what was it? Like this, I like that. So, or um, kitty cat here, or this paper that I love, I wanted to put in there, or this stuff that I got. So, I mean, I don't think it has to be, you know, it can be whatever you want it to be. And the little tigress daisy. So thanks for watching and uh, I hope I didn't bore you to death and uh, I hope I encourage you to try this yourself because it is really fun and stretching. This one I found hard because I want to do certain things. I wanted this in there which sort of didn't go along at all but then as you see there's a little bit of green in this paper and there's green here and there's green here I added. So I mean I think it turned out great. Okay so until next time bye.